next week's show um, to talk about. We'll probably need a big talking point to talk about on next week's show. I'm sort of feeling like whether the Combined Nations match is a waste of time or not could be a talking point. <laughs> but particularly if England have gone down to the scratch side being coached by God knows who. Well, Ellery Hanley, isn't it? There you go. Ellery, Ellery, who's not had anything to do with rugby league for years, is probably going to come in and take Sean Wayne's pants down. <laughs> and I don't necessarily think it's Sean Wayne's fault. It, I, Who but, picks that but then squad? again, he's picked this squad, hasn't he? Exactly, he's picked the squad. Yeah. <coughs> I, look, if I was, if I was him, I'd be on to Paul Wellen saying you're fucking sacked if James Roby does not play for us in this World Cup. <laughs> What are you doing in my backroom staff if you're not getting your best fucking mate to play? <laughs> yeah, well, yeah. So people getting the views on that, obviously on the game itself, um, in terms of the match action, we always want to talk about that on this show. That's that's our bread and butter. But also views as fans on on the concept, on on what we, on whether we think it's going to be useful or not, whether we can even tell whether it's going to be useful or not. You know, whether you want, whether you're in, interested in it, whether like the best thing about it is the kits and the fact that some money from the kits is going to the Tongan Relief Fund, and then everything else about it is kind of meh. Yeah. <sighs> also, also, give us your lowdowns on what your best plans are for Magic Weekend. I want to hear that. I want to yes. get that. I want to. I want to start getting those plans in order. Where is it we're going to be eating and drinking for the Magic Weekend, folks? Yes, and also best ice creams in Newcastle. Oh, that let's get would be planning. Good. Let's get planning. <laughs> or just best ice creams anywhere. Let's get people telling <laughs> us about the favourite ice cream they've ever had. Where was it? This no, is the was... best I've had since I had some in. in um, we had. I had an amazing, like, I think it was like a lemon sorbet type. Mm. It was a lemon flavored thing, but it wasn't quite a sorbet and it wasn't quite an ice cream. But it was like, well, it was like a gelato store. So I guess gelato isn't quite ice cream, but isn't quite whatever. But in that was in Florence. That was really good. It was massive. Do the Italians know how to do ice yeah. cream? They really do. But this is the best ice cream I've had since that. Since then. Yeah. Right, yo. Okay. Um,. And it'll be me and Alan talking about it next week. So if you've got any vegan ice cream recommendations as well for poor old Alan, <laughs> then get them in too. <laughs> there will be some. I'm sure there will be. Do you want to remind people how they can get in touch, where they can find I us, that sort of stuff? Will, will, I will. I will. Uh, you can uh, find us and show the show on at Super League Pod on Twitter and Instagram, uh, facebook.com forward slash Super League Pod, Super League Pod at gmail.com, Super League Pod.com. Search for the show on Spreaker, Apple Podcasts, Google Podcasts, Podcast Addict, Stitcher, Spotify, Overcast, or anywhere you normally find your podcasts. And we're on YouTube too. Excellent stuff. Uh, shout out to our friends before we say goodbye. Rob's Megasaur, enter SLP10 on checkout, get 10% off your order. Little Warden, vital alerts for hidden issues, head to littlewarden.com to see what they can do for you. And Sarah's bookcase, Sarah sells Usborn books with access to over 3,000 titles from baby to young adults. There's something for everyone. Find out more on the Sarah's bookcase Facebook or Twitter pages. Um, good stuff. I'm glad that the internet managed to get us through the show one way or another. David, I'm glad that we got to talk about ice cream. Basically, uh, James Roby and ice cream are the two overriding things yeah. that I'm going to remember from this recording. Two main, two main topics, man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. Lovely to speak to you again, Mark, and uh, speak to you again soon. Yes, good stuff. And speak to everyone else again out there soon. Thanks for listening again to your favourite rugby league podcast, the Super League Pod. See you again. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.